What's going on guys, it's Bros and Bros. Welcome to another video on Black Ops 4. Uh, the last video was just a little fun video of me and my buddies just, you know, chilling out on the map. I believe it was called, uh, Hacienda, if I pronounce that right. I don't know. I apologize if I mispronounce it, but fuck it, I don't give a shit. Moving on guys, this video is just a quick thing about the Gold Camel Black Ops 4 and my opinion on why it's a letdown. It, it's just, it's anticlimactic when you earn, I mean... It's climactic, but I'll get to the point of the video. Um, one downside of Black Ops 4, in my opinion, is there's no fledged campaign, which, let's be honest here, Special HQ ain't much of a campaign. It's just teaching how to use the operators, which are pretty easy just from going to the game and using. Uh, my favorite, you know, and most used, uh, what's it called, operator, or whatever they want to call them. I really don't know what they call them in this game. The characters is Seraph, that annihilated pistol decimates and attack the blood beacons. Actually, pretty lit to get a good, you know, good run around on enemies. Pretty lit, pretty useful in my opinion. But hey, moving on to the video. This is my Spitfire class. This is the class I mainly run around with, unless I'm in a long range map and I use the, you know, the Hades or other classes. I have this class made up because it's a carbon copy of my Spitfire class minus attachments. And because I'm working on getting gold on the, all the other SMGs, but that's, that's besides the point. But um, this is the penthouse camo, as clearly said right here. Because the penthouse camo is whew, by far my favorite camo, minus the times I picked up, you know, weapons out of diamond or dark matter. Pretty lit, I ain't gonna lie. But um, just my opinion is these are the performance challenges. It covers up part of the weapons, makes sense. It was just low end camos technical some of them were pretty good penthouse is lit i ain't gonna lie but guys the gold camo on black ops 4 is, is a bit of a letdown in my opinion but hell still worth unlocking to aid in the process of unlocking diamond camo and then eventually the coveted dark matter camo which is a long long way away for me because i like gravitating towards weapons i do good with which in this case is spitfire the rampart hades and such like that moving on I personally think the gold camo should be, you know, should cover the entirety of the weapon, such as Penthouse does. That is a beautiful camo, and that is a camo I will always stick with on every weapon that I earn and all, until I get diamond or dark matter, of course. But, um, but heck, this is my opinion. I personally think that gold camo should cover the entirety of the weapon. It is a good shade of gold, believe me. I guess it's as good as a camo in a game about shooting each other and defeating the enemy forces I guess you want to call it but hell like I said penthouse beautiful camo covers the entirety of the weapon every little bit of the weapons covered and has a design on it gold doesn't kind of upsetting I wish the entirety of the weapon was covered in gold and a bit shinier I haven't used gold yet in, in game and I'll probably be changing up my opinion after this and if it does uh, I'll be making another video ex just changing my opinion and redoing the video for like the fifth time because getting interrupted realizing I have Elgato sound capture on and it records the music I'm listening to uh, but hell this is my opinion y'all uh, let me know what you think down in the comment section below let me know if you agree that the whole gold camo should cover the whole entirety of the weapon let me know what your favorite camo is yeah or even out of the zombies camo which I don't really have many of and we're working towards getting Silverfish. Because Silverfish actually looks pretty lit. And so does Emerald UG. I'm actually curious on that one. But hell, I got a long way away. <laughs> Gotta get a lot of headshots and zombies. Which I'm, it's going to take some time. A lot of time. A lot of playing on Coliseum. Doing train around the middle part of the map. But hell, that's just my opinion. Don't want to get off topic. Um, if y'all enjoyed the video, like I said, leave a like down below. And leave in the comments. My Leave the comments. Hey. <laughs> leave in the comments down below. Your opinion on it. Just let me know what you think, and if you agree with me, let me know.